Hello guys, how are you all doing? Oh my goodness. Now, um, yeah, I've been out for a while, more than a month, I think. Yeah, and um, it's not intentional. I haven't been feeling well, but thank goodness I am fine now and I am back. Okay, now I just want to say a big, big thank you to all my viewers, all my followers, all my supporters that have been sending me messages asking me what is going on. We've not seen your video for a very long time. When are you, you know, putting another video? I am so, so grateful. Thank you so much. So, our video today is about exfoliant that helps in getting rid of skin bleaching bone, the severe hyperpigmentations. If this is your first time coming across my channel, my name is Chika Kelly. I am so, so glad to have you. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm a certified esthetician and this channel is all about skincare. I teach you how to achieve that clear glowing skin and keeping your skin popping and helping you recommend skincare products that will help in your journey. To achieving a radiant glowing skin okay so if you like what you're watching don't forget to subscribe when you subscribe it keeps you up to date on when I upload videos and as you're subscribing you hit the bell button as well the bell button will get you notified when new videos comes up on my channel okay share this video share 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 to help the you know the the video to um, get to people that it will really, really benefit, that will really, really benefit from it. Okay, and hit the like button. Thank you so much. And for my regular viewers, mwah, I love you. Thank you. And skin bleaching bond is something that I'm very passionate about because it has damaged a lot of people's skin. Some it's usually caused by when you use um, skincare products that has very high percentage of hydroquinone and mercury in it um, some steroids okay and um, using it and especially not applying your sunscreen and as a result you get your skin tissue damaged and from your skin tissue being damaged it can result to burn and the burn depends on different degrees uh how many you know because sometimes the bond can be a little bit too deep and um, those ones are what we call the uh, ochronosis and ochronosis is um is hyperpigmentation like more like a, an irreversible hyperpigmentation sometimes depending on the treatment that you get you may get your natural skin color a little bit back sometimes maybe you, you may not okay that is why it's advisable to always check your ingredients always check what you're buying and watch once you start using it watch the reaction of the product on your skin to decide if this is good for me or not okay now i'll be telling you two of my favorite exfoliants that actually works there are other exfoliants that you can use so don't just say oh Chickelly Beauty said you must only use these two. No, but I'm just telling you the two exfoliants that I know I've recommended to some of my clients that works for them. So the first one is the Ordinary Azelic Acid Suspension 10%. Okay, this particular ingredient and this particular skincare product is favored by a lot of skincare specialists, especially 
qualified estheticians and dermatologists and the reason is because it has a brightening effect okay and it's very azelic acid one thing i love about it is every skin type can use it even people with rosacea rosacea is a skin um issue that um usually result is like people with rosacea has very sensitive skin so they are very careful on what they use on their skin azelic acid can be used by all skin types it helps to fade hyperpigmentation and it brightens your skin it fades like it's very good with, with, uh, on blemish blemish prone skin acne prone skin it works fantastic okay and you can pair it with other acids so it's more or less gentle on skin it's very very good for chemical bond skin bleaching bond okay with your hyperpigmentation so um it's something i recommend i recommend it to almost all my client because it's very effective on um, bone and steroid acne that is caused by skin bleaching bone okay and the second one is ascorbic acid 15 percent okay ascorbic acid one thing i love about it is is good it helps with wound healing remember when your skin tissue is born is is a wound is an open you know is a wound yeah when your skin tissue is burnt, is a wound. And this is why I usually tell my clients that when your skin tissue is burnt, don't use anything strong. Don't go using, using something that says lightening, uh, whitening, because it's going to make it worse. Your the hyperpigmentation will get worse. It may brighten it for a while, but when you stop, it's going to get worse. So anything that says whitening, lightening, stay away from it for a while until you the the wound is healed once the wound is healed your natural skin color comes back to its original form your skin cells are healed is replenished and then you can start looking for lightening give yourself a very long time it's better you use hydrating ingredients skincare products that has hydrating properties those are going to help to heal your skin tissue you eat well vegetables loads of things vegetables loads of greens to help regenerate your cell that will help also in healing your skin tissue so ascorbic acid 15 percent helps with wound healing and it also adds an anti, as an antioxidant and antioxidants are cells the cells that help with cell regeneration okay and okay and also one thing i love about it it helps protect your skin from damaging i know damages caused by free radicals pollution sun damage so it helps to protect your skin so when you use the ascorbic acid for 15 percent not only would it help to heal the womb not only will it help to regenerate the cells around that area where you have the skin tissue bone it will also protect your skin from you know getting more burnt <laughs> and damaged by sun now how do you use this two exfoliants remember they are exfoliants okay so you're not supposed to use it every single day in as much as azelic acid is that gentle on the skin but it's still an exfoliant so you have to use it like three to four times a week i preferably recommend you use it at night and don't use the two of them the same time okay you have to you know alternate between the two and use it after you must have cleansed your skin properly apply your facial toner and then you have you can use that uh, if you watch some of my videos where i did how to a uh, skincare routine at night skincare routine if you watch this video here it will show you what your skincare routine night skincare routine should look like okay don't forget your sunscreen your sunscreen is very important because it's going to help to stop the hyperpigmentation from getting 
darker and if you just have a newly skin tissue born and you you want to start getting your natural skin color back your skin will get darker because a lot of my clients complain about it is the normal process your skin will get darker and darker and darker because your skin tissue is healing but give it some time after a while your natural skin color will start coming back as long as the damage is not irreversible okay be consistent and be patient hyperpigmentation does not fade overnight you have to be consistent you have to be patient and you have to use the right skincare product okay and it will fade over time all right so these are my two favorite exfoliant that works for skin bleaching bone okay you can try them on but sometimes what works for a may not work for b but i'm only showing you my viewers because you've been asking me about it and because i've been recommended in it for my clients that have skin bleaching bone and it's working for them okay i hope you find this video very helpful and um make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you have subscribed and become part of this small community and also leave a comment below in the comment section have you used any of this product that i've you know i've mentioned in this video is it working for you what are you using and what is working for you do you have skin tissue bone and you need help send me a dm and we'll see what we can do okay thank you so much and i look forward to seeing you in my next video Mwah.